work out your spray. Here, I'll do it low since you have your burger. Whoop, whoop. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> now you smell like good, good, good young men. <laughs> Look in here. We gotta get your swimsuit. I forgot you guys are swimming today. I mean, you guys are going to the water today. You guys ready? I gotta go get you a swimming. Yeah. All right, guys, let's go. when you are being productive and trying to put your mind to a goal, all of those weeks will fly. We're about to head to the gym, about to get our meat and get our food, and we're gonna have a good day. This is the last vlog style video of the 18 week series. Next week, I'll give y'all a breakdown of everything, my final weigh in, oh my gosh. And I'll tell you guys what to expect next, what I have planned, what God is showing me, where I'm supposed to go, the whole nine. Have an even shorter time to hit my goal. Week 17, woo! Let's do this. our meat the hot boiling wind is in our face and we love it y'all i love arizona so much i used to live in texas corpus christi to be exact that's where selena grew up come on la floor. but anyways the air was so humid it was like thick like like it was just like sweaty nasty horrible but dry heat i for some reason like i can work with that it could be 200 degrees in dry heat now i'm gonna get in and get out but for some reason i could deal with that better i don't know can i have a two new york strips you know what you want so you're fine I'm i do fine. <laughs> yeah it's you're like not, that perfect protein yeah 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 10 out of 10 recommend. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and then 
And then can I have two T-bone steaks? <laughs> How are you? Good. Huh? It's going good. Yeah. Okay, and then may I have um fond of your beef cubes? Then we can do two filet mignons and I'm done. Okay. Oh, this looks good. Thank you. You guys have a good night. I can't wait to cook all this. Y'all know y'all heard me sounding like a professional in there. That was too crazy. I was like, <clears throat> yes, I would like two of these, four of these, three of these, and a pound of this. They said, okay. So I guess you know what you're doing and you know what you want. And at this point, I guess I'm a cow butcher myself. But <laughs> <laughs> don't yell like that again, please, Lazarus. I gave it to you. Thank you, buddy. I want earth. Okay. That's what. Well, this is the stuff that I'll be craving and missing. Well, I don't crave it, it's fine, but Mom, I just miss the taste of those. But apparently, I don't need them, so. There's that. Huh? They're going in the car. Okay, we're gonna go in the car. Have a good day. Come on, Junior. <laughs> this boy done helped this lady take all her groceries out with just forcefully too. Come on, guys. Can somebody open this? Okay, sure. One second. Y'all look what I'm adding this week. Oh! I've been waiting on this, y'all. We're just taking it one step at a time. Add in onions while your kid pulls on you. Nothing better in mine. Look at that, y'all. And there we have it. Look at this meaty goodness. It's actually super juicy. Like, now I see why people are offended when people use, um, like, seasoning. I mean, like, sauce on their steak. Because I got the juiciest buttery steak you've ever heard of. And then look at those onions. Mm-hmm. Say last week, I drank Propel. I didn't have any sparkling water. So this week, sparkling water and onions have made an introduction. Let's go. Okay, amen. Mm, 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 mm. Okay, y'all, it is nighttime, and I don't know, like, it has to be my period coming, because, like, I'm about to eat some popcorn and some of my son half onions. Like, I was trying to go to sleep, and it, it was like, my body was like, eat everything in this house as fast as possible. And I was like, oh my gosh, why am I doing this? Like, am I not, like, progressing? Like, what is going on? Then I looked at my calendar. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I was like, oh, it's just that time. So I just got to share this with y'all because I'm about to eat this. I'm about to eat some goldfish. I. It's good to fight, but sometimes you just got to. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay, you ready to brush your teeth? Yeah, gym class with your friends. Rise and shine, my beautiful people. So, today. So, today, we're about to head to the gym and do two classes. Yesterday, I was eating crazy at nighttime because my the time of the month is near and dear. And I might wear some protection to the gym just in case. Okay? But. It's all good. When we do stuff like that, we get up the next day and we go harder, okay? So let's go. All right, y'all, one class is in the studio. I can't record it, but the other one is on the floor. So I'm gonna record it. I'm gonna give you everything you need to do. Let's do this. The gym air, I just love it. Well, outside the gym air. I just love it. Here's Theo. 
They think just because we're in public, they can do whatever they want and I'm not going to redirect or correct them or discipline them. You got the wrong one on the right day! Do y'all kids be doing that, like trying to play you because you're in public? Like you gonna shut the whole system down? I don't care who, hey, get your mind right! Get your mind right, yeah! Get your mind right! Music to my ears, it's whiny babies, cause those is tired babies. Come on somebody! <laughs> Y'all, I have went everywhere looking for a seeded watermelon. And this heat, baby! It's hot, ain't it y'all? It's like, why can I not fight a seeded, seeded watermelon? I'm not giving up on it though. I'm gonna keep searching. love this with some thank you notes is daddy gonna love that yeah. Yeah. wow this was a good idea guys good job okay good job. no that's an orange orange you just open it No, you don't wash it. You just open it. Do Would you like me to help you open it? No. Okay. I'll just go bite it. Okay. Oh, okay. No, just like open it with your... Okay. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. My 
first meal of the day is 219. That T-bone steak yesterday was talking to me. So we got the T-bone steak with the luscious juices, okay? And then I have a bowl of blackberries because blackberries get me every time. And Heavenly Father, thank you for this food. Thank you for this day. Thank you for the breath in our lungs. Thank you for the person watching this. Please bless their home, bless their marriage, bless their finances, bless their children, bless their legacy and destiny. In your holy name we pray, amen. Woo, yeah. I Ever since I started adding like other foods a little by little and eating different types of seasoning with my meat, I am not tired of it, y'all. I, I really am not. I was actually excited the whole way here to eat this, so. Mm -hmm. I probably should have made an egg. My favorite part is the fat. I gotta look up if it's healthy to be eating that, because the way I be throwing it down. Uh-huh. Mm-hmm. 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 All right, y'all. This is what we ended with. I literally was thinking about sucking the meat off the entire bone, but that's what we got. Now I'm about to take a shower and take a nap. I'm not gonna burn your hand. What are you talking about? I'm gonna burn my head out. Oh yeah, if you touch it, yes, yes, yes. All right, y'all. Here's my final plate. We got the. I'm talking about my hormones. Said put it on there. Okay. My body said, eat a lot. So we'll see. I put the shrimp and then we have my favorite New York strip steak. This is my man's. I gave him more onions because I love onions so much. So anything I love, I try to give him more of. And I have him some veggies coming and we about to eat. And I'll show you what I don't eat if I don't eat. Look what I got for you. Oh, you get it. Oh. oh, you out here. Okay. Uh-huh. You didn't even know what I was going to. I don't, but I know you better split that up. What you mean? Like, that's a lot of food for you. I know, but I'm about to be on my period, so. I don't, that don't mean you can just throw everything away. Throw it away? No, like, I'm saying, like, throw away all your goals because you're about to be on your period. Oh no, I'm not throwing away my goals. All right, this is what I have left. My husband gave me this because it's just like fat. And I'm probably gonna cook it a little bit more in the morning because it started to get red towards the middle. But I just think that's because of how thick they are. But I'm about to put this in a little container and then I'm gonna go to bed as soon as possible so I don't start eating the drywall out of this house, okay? I need to just go to bed. Cause I'm not hungry, I'm satisfied. But, yeah. So good night. Good morning, y'all. Today, I'm right now on my way to take my mom to the airport and I'm going to get their babies. They don't know, so that's gonna be exciting. But anyways, um, last night, the meat and the shrimp was the last thing I ate. No, I had another bowl of berries. So for my normal day today, when I'm not about to be on my period, that is a lot of food. Let's see what my body says today. And then I have a yoga today because I did intense classes yesterday, but today I'm gonna stretch. I'm probably gonna get in the jacuzzi because we can't forget to stretch and we can't forget about mobility and stability in the body because that's how you avoid pain and stiffness and all that weird stuff. So we gonna stretch. I'm gonna try to find a seeded watermelon. Yeah, I'm gonna see my mama. I love her so much. Today's gonna be a good day. Let's go. I'm sorry. I there she I is. Look at the light. Light. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You guys ready? Who's dad? <laughs> Y'all, it's not even 11 a.m. 
by the end of this day, I'm going to be done drove about four hours. Four or five hours. Hey, but sometimes you got to let loose and have fun and do some cool things. Okay, you guys go to class and have a good time. Go to class, Wazzy. I love you. Hurry for a car comes. Hello. I'm gonna go in there in a second. I'm trying, girl. I'm trying. Get it, get it. Woo -woo. But instead, he's given you the strength of endurance to walk through where you're at in life. Mm -hmm. To make it through with good attitudes, to make it through living for him, serving him in the way that we need to serve him. But he gives us that strength. You may not see, you may not hear from, you may not feel. You may read his word and it just goes numb in your ears because of the struggle that you're in. But God is still there giving you the strength to endure. Is this vinyl or something like that? Heated yoga? Heated. Yes. Okay. they say Pilates is like way harder than everything else because it was like like it be getting intense into all your stuff I don't be knowing all the moves so I need to do that but yeah we did it that's what we got for today mm-hmm our first meal say hi papa hi this is pretty easy it is Are you okay? Wow. Lazarus! <laughs> this is my sister! Okay. Okay, let's see. Hours later, y'all. They gonna sleep so good. Y'all need a sandwich with some Dorito chips in it. Come on, somebody! Okay, y'all. This is what I have left. So I'm going to... Put my New York strip in the, it was too red if you remember from yesterday. So I'm gonna put this in the air fryer and then like for three seconds I'll add the shrimp. Mm -hmm. All right, here is the final of it all. This is such a perfect amount. Y'all better use that air fryer and stop playing. I gotta play. Mom, mom, mom. What? Why would you do that? Mom, mom, mom remember this? Um, um. Stop, buddy. Mom, <laughs> I think I broke my leg. Say why. Why? Stop, boy. Because, because I hit it with a fork. When was that? Like a long time ago. But it was like, doctor, guess what? I was like, doctor. I hit it. Like, oh, okay, let's pray. Hold on, let's pray. Oh, 
cash. I need to do it. I need to do it. Oh, me want to make you a black flip. What? Oh, me want to make you a black flip. <laughs> do I want to see you do a backflip? Yeah. Let, can you say that again? Good morning, guys. So today I have a Pilates fusion class. Pilates is so deep, like in the core. When I did Pilates, I think it was like week five or week six with my friend Yanni, I was like, oh my gosh, this is harder than the weights and the cardio, like any strength training hit that I've ever done because like you have to use every single muscle. I didn't know how to dress, but I know you, I think you don't wear like gym shoes. So I got my sandals, I got some stretchiness on. I'm bringing my gym shoes just in case. But let me drop these kids off. Okay, y'all, really quick about my skin, because like I would never have wore this type of shirt like this in the beginning of this. And mind you, it started in November 2023 as one dot. By like January, it was like covering me. So anyways, with autoimmune stuff or stuff happening in your life, it's like it, it sometimes can easily make you go, why me, Lord? Like, why me? You know what I mean? I'm getting to the final goal weight that I haven't been since I don't know when. I'm doing everything that I can physically to improve my life. And like now I can't even do this without stuff all over my skin. Like really, you know, it's easy to do that. And in the beginning I did, I was like, are you serious? I was like, okay, Lord. I was like, oh, I need to have a talk with Jesus. Okay, but the whole point of this part is to tell you the serenity prayer, apply it to your life because it really has helped me to be like, anyway, like, oh, well, this is where I'm at in life. And, and the serenity prayer is, Lord, give me the serenity to accept the things that I cannot change and the courage to change the things that I can and then the wisdom to know the difference. That prayer helps me so much because at the end of the day, the only thing I can do about this is keep going to the doctor, keep trying things, looking up stuff, looking up remedies. I'm going to get my blood taken a day to check my vitamin D, all this stuff. But in the meantime, what I can control, come on, somebody, I can control my joy. I can control um, my attitude. I can control, you know. I can look at the glass half full instead of half empty and put on my little shirt and say, anyways, come on, I'm going. What are we doing? Okay. So I just want to tell you real quick, whatever happens in your life that you cannot control, that is keeping you either from your goal, your sanity, your mental health, whatever it is, focus on the serenity prayer and understand what you can control is where your vision needs to always be because that's how you get further. All right, let's go work out. Y'all, I done left my gym shoes, so hopefully we don't use them. But look at these trees, y'all. I don't ever get tired of palm trees in Arizona. Palm trees in the mountains. Look at the mountains over there. I don't know if you can see it, but 10 out of 10. Recommend. Love your life. I love that. <laughs> I'm done I didn't break a sweat at all um but I feel my core more contracted and sometimes like especially in the beginning of me working out I felt like if I wasn't sweating and like gripping on to dear life at the end of the workout I didn't really get a good workout and that's such a toxic mentality 
in your fitness journey towards yourself because then you miss all the deep engaging stuff so yeah i feel very relaxed i feel very um i feel my core contracted and it was a great workout uh, the sweat that y'all see right now is because of the az heat okay so don't make the mistakes that i did feeling like you have to do the most hard intense thing you can to get a good workout because that's a lie come on somebody what I knew he was gonna say that. I'm eating more meat. You you know good and well you ain't hungry. Okay, y'all. I literally have been giving my air fryer a run for his money today. I'm telling you right now. Oh, it's smoking. Is this okay? Come here, babies. Oh, hello. Let's cancel that. My body is just, I don't know. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Air fryer. Thank you. So here you have it. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, hey, baby. Y'all tell me why. Oh. Okay, y'all. So let's start with this. I burned 515 calories in that class. I've never done cycling before. Well, I think I've done it like once or twice, but that was like a sculpting one. And y'all, working out is so much more than your body. Is cause like, we was just working out. I was not expecting to cry, right? We was just working out. And then she started to talk about how in life, you just gotta push through and like how our strength is in our mind and our body has to like succumb to that and like we're strong and we can get through and I just always feel like stuff is piling on me like I have so much to do and it's never ending and until we get to heaven we don't have that true peace so I'm just like going through it this week and I'm just like boo-hooing crying and um she hugged me at the end but so yeah, you look good, but also mentally you push yourself and you leave knowing that you can do it, you know? So yeah, you can do it. I'm probably about to go to another class. And this is so funny. <laughs> I'm like boohooing like a little baby. Life is hard and it gets harder. And um, you're always trying to catch up, I feel like as a mom. and. You're always doing stuff for other people. You don't get that time to yourself to like recover. Even in your recovery, you're around people. So you affect them, you know, or they're dependent upon you. But that's why I go to the gym and take care of myself. Cause now I feel like invincible, you know, spiritually and mentally. Actually spiritually, I'm about to go read my Bible. That's what I need to do. <sighs> All right, let's go.